Baked it myself, words and all. <sighs> George. I'm only joking. I am Fred. Can you imagine the look and all we're gonna go to space if we were late? Perhaps it would be more useful if I were to transfigure Mr. Potter and yourself into a pocket watch. I would rather passing home. What shame was trying to do to that glass of water? Turn it to rum. Thank <laughs> <laughs> God, Leviosa. Well done, Thank dear. God. <laughs> Oh. I'll do the candle curse. You just set my bloody kneecaps on fire. I don't appreciate the insinuation, Longbottom. My eyebrows have completely grown back. Oh. 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 Shut up, Harry. <laughs> stop, stop, stop. You're going to take someone's eye out. Besides, you're saying it wrong. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. I checked this out weeks ago for a bit of light reading. This is light. Then I led him to Dumbledore to guard the... Yes? Shouldn't have said that. No more questions. Don't ask any more questions. What that dog is guarding is strictly between Professor Dumbledore and Nicholas Flamel. Nicholas Flamel? I shouldn't have said that. I should not have said that. You'll have to be trained up a bit, of course. <laughs> and Harry, you'll go with Malfoy. Okay, then I get Fang. He's a bloody coward. Uh, but I think I could be safe with a nice toffee. A lot. Earwax. You must know all about muggles. Tell me, what exactly is the function of a rubber duck? Oh. <laughs> Bloody birds are menace. And now, Mr. Weasley, if you would. Have an owl deliver these release papers to Azkaban. The owl that delivered my release papers got all lost and confused. Some ruddy bird called Errol. And now I suggest that we all return to the feast. There is a delicious looking custard tart that I am most anxious to sup. Uh, Longbottom's been neglecting his earmuffs. No, ma'am. He's just fainted. Yes, well, just leave him there. Right, on we go. We'll, we'll bring, bring you straight home! Oh, and Ginny, dear, congratulations on making Gryffindor. Your father and I are so proud. Oh. Oh. Ah, the point is, uh, you can no longer feel any pain. And <laughs> very clearly, the bones are not broken. Hello. Who are you? Ron Weasley. Really? And, uh, who, who am I? As a school treat, all exams have been cancelled. Come now, Harry. The Ministry doesn't send people to Azkaban for blowing up their aunt. <laughs> Keeping. I'll come back later. A cat? Is that what they told you? Looks more like a pig with hair, if you ask me. That's rich coming from the owner of that smelly old shoe brush. It's all right, Crookshanks. You just ignore the mean little boy. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be such a wind, Longbottom. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Ridiculous! <laughs> Ridiculous. Yes. Very good. Very good. Marvelous. Spoiler. Spoiler. 
Spiders. You want me to tap dance? I don't want to tap dance. You please. tell those spiders wrong. Oh, yeah, I tell, I tell, I tell. I tell. I tell. Is that really what my hair looks like from the back? Oh, Hermione. Here in the runway! They drink only single malt whiskey. You idiot! Don't worry, completely harmless. She's lethal. What are you laughing at? A genius like Dumbledore couldn't possibly be fooled by a dog just pathetically dim-witted as an ageing potion. Yeah, but that's why it's so brilliant. Because it's so pathetically dim-witted. <laughs> yes! <laughs> you said, you said! <laughs> Stinking! Cowardly! Scummy! Professor Muggins! What, what are you doing? Teaching. Ginny, these must be for you. Not wearing that, it's ghastly. <laughs> what are you on about? They're not for Ginny. They're for you. <laughs> Bumbling band of baboons. Try saying that five times faster. Now oh, to I dance? is to let the body... Will you join me, please? Mm. Place your right hand on my waist. Where? My waist. And extend your arm. <laughs> Oi! Never gonna let him forget this, are you? Never. Oh. Come with me. <laughs> Tonight, when we get back to the common room, we'll both have partners. Agreed? Agreed. Oh! Well, I expect yours are more traditional. Traditional? They're ancient. I look like my great aunt Tessie. Smell like my great aunt Tessie. Like a crazy elf. A dancer by herself. A boogie dancer. Someone. <laughs> 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 Promise you'll write the summer. Both of you. Well, I won't. You know I won't. Harry will, won't you? Yeah, every week. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be eating down in the kitchen. Oh! Just because you're allowed to use magic now does not mean you have to whip your wands out for everything! Do you ever stop eating? Oh, I'm hungry. Exciting, isn't it? Breaking the rules. Who are you and what have you done with Hermione Granger? Thank you. Shut up. I let her do that. One person couldn't feel all that. It'd explode. Just because you've got the emotional range of a teaspoon. <laughs> <laughs> I can't understand why you don't want to wear it, Ronald. Like a bloody idiot, that's why. No more than usual, Ronald. Right. Names? Professor Flitwick, you've known me for five years. No exceptions, Potter. There is serum. And that was <laughs> terribly tricky to make. Mrs. Amortentia. When I 
was curious. So I went to the, the library. library. And? You know, she's got nice skin. Skin? You're saying Dean's dating my sister because of her skin? Well, no, I mean, I'm just... I'm just saying it could be a contributing factor. Hey, she's only interested in you because she thinks you're the chosen one. But I am the chosen one. Okay, sorry. Um, kidding. <laughs> you just bought yourself a month's detention, McLagan. Not so quick, Potter. I just thought you could whip up a remedy for this in no time, Harry. Oh, I, I thought this called for a more practised hand, sir. Hello, darling. How's your drink? Perhaps you're right. Good God. Dear fellow, however did you manage to kill it? Kill it? My oldest friend he was. Fair warning. It tastes like goblin piss. I have lots of experiences with that, dear Maddo. Just trying to defuse the tension. Bill, look away. I'm hideous. I knew she was lying about that tattoo. Harry, your eyesight really is awful. Morning. Thank you. Come, Daddy. Harry doesn't want to talk to us right now. He's just too polite to say so. Mary, do as I say. <laughs> Mary? Something hidden here in the castle. And it may help us defeat you know who. What is it? We don't know. Where is it? We don't know that either. I realise it's not much to go on. That's nothing to go on. Harry. Hi there. Six months you haven't seen me, and it's like I'm Frankie first year. Pierre Totem Locomotor! I've always wanted to use that spell. Well, I must say I'd hoped for better. <laughs> and who might you be, young man? Neville Longbottom. 